Thank you very much. Uh, Anna Vandensky from Brussels Diplomatic. I have a question on migration because our previously Mr. Petala here told that he would support sanctions against the countries who are, not, uh, who are reluctant to take migrants. So w would you also support the sanctions and do you think that our, this is a way to solve the crisis or it's a, a solution for the migrant crisis for the moment? Uh, we have to find a solution till 2019, that's clear. So in this mandate, we have to clarify to give a proper answer from the European Union towards the new dimension of migration, globally speaking. And, uh, and I still, and EZPP, we still think that we have to talk to each other. We have to find a common understanding. We shouldn't force each other. We should talk to each other, first of all. And that means we simply count that on council level, uh, there will be a process, is a process going on. Again, I think that uh, we have some very highly political issues on the table. One is the migration thing. And there I think, and I ask really the European Council to jump into the topics. Huh? We don't need further council meetings, European Council meetings, where we have only copy and paste about the decisions of the past, of the last uh, council meetings. We need progress. And that's why it is the job of our leading institution, that's the European Council, to give a proper orientation how we can solve problems. And in the migration thing for us as EPP, we have two uh, major, let me say, points. One is that we think that we have to protect our borders. So that is a precondition before we start in all the domestic and internal discussions. The so precondition is we have to stop illegal migration, fight against smugglers, protect our borders. And the second point is, the second most important point is, to find a mechanism to practice solidarity. Because it is a European issue, it's not an issue only for Italy or, or Greece, it is a European issue, and that's why we have to find an answer on this solidarity question. These are the two principles which, is, which are guiding the, the European People's Party. And again, uh, I ask the European Council to not only talk general things, to not only discuss general points, they have to give orientation and to have to give guidance for the other institutions to come to conclusions.